Family is where the love begins. Welcome to Sapugay Family, the clan of small people and flat nose. Yes, we are proud to be truly blooded Filipino. Presenting to you, my mother and my father. My mom and my dad used to fight every single day. That's why our house became the center of attraction in the neighborhood. Every night, every fight, we feel that everything is falling apart. And the worst day came. Our father finally go with his mistress and leave us forever. And we never heard from him again. But let me flex to you, my father. He is Jose Valentin Sapugay. But no, he wasn't born during Valentine's Day. My papa, he is funny and cool. He cooks good and sings well. I love the way he sings. He is very good at it. I hope I got the skills but sadly, I'm not in tune. He is very talented and thanks to him, I got my art skills. My father is a very responsible man that sometimes he works 24-7 to fulfill our needs. He always makes us laugh even he is tired by throwing his funny jokes. Even we are naughty, he never laid hands to us. Our relationship to him is unconditional. I really love my father and I really miss him. That's why it's very hard to let him go. It's very hard. Presenting to you, my mother. Her name in English is Ki. In Tagalog, Susi. She is Susi Sapugay. My mom is always scary and serious when I was a kid. When there is a visitor and we are very naughty, she will just stare at us. And you know what that means, right? That means that we need to behave or else she will beat us when the visitor is gone. We... Her four kids is not close to her because she is a low-tempered person. She shouted to us when we did not do our task at home. She beats us when we forgot our homeworks. And we never heard her says, I love you to us, even once. But before we go to school, she wakes up so early to make us breakfast. She will prepare our uniform and even comb our hair. She is the first one who will be proud of and get excited about our achievements. And to tell you a story, after I got the first place in the regional painting competition in our province, she spread the news all over the barangay. It's weird, right? But maybe she's just very proud. Our mom used to tell us that education is the only treasure she can give us. And you know what I love the most about my mom? That she stays with us no matter what. Presenting to you my brother, Mike Angelo Sapugay. And his name is very compatible to his personality because he is so angelic. Our neighbors used to tease him that he is the real girl in the siblings because of the way he reacts to the range of our mother. He will just cry. Unlike us, the girls, we will reason out as long as we can. My brother is the most obedient person I've ever known. He is very responsible. He became our breadwinner when our father left us. And I am very proud to say that despite of all the difficulties in our life, he managed to graduate and became a professional automotive. I am very proud to him. And now, presenting to you my only older sister, Janet. I used to not call her ate because she don't want to. She is my number one enemy in the world because she is so annoying. She always used my coloring materials without my permission. And she is very sip-sip to our parents. 
But despite of all the fights, we shared a lot of happy memories when we were kids. I know that she truly loves me, even she is not showy. I proved that one time at school when my classmates bullied me. She defended me there. And that is the day I realized that she really cares about me. When we get older, we became partners in crime. We keep each other's secret, and to tell you, Janet is a very intelligent person. She always got a perfect score in her exams. And her motto in life, hardworking is the key for everything. And today, she is a licensed teacher. And last but not the least, our youngest sister, Jennifer. But I used to call her Jennifruit. She is totally like me stubborn and naughty, yet very talented. She is a strong woman and independent in life. She used to bring achievements from school competition, and normally we fight like every sisters do. And now, she is carrying a blessing and we expect it next year. And currently, she is the Preggy Call Center agent ng Legaspi. And aloha! This is me, your one and only Janice. Ang future teacher na Oragon ng Sorsogon! Thank you for watching!